Health Watch right now, there's new proof that having a drink a day may protect you against heart disease. Of course, the word in this study, keyword there is moderation, of course. Our medical expert, Dr. Kevin Campbell, joins us live right here in the studio to talk about this. So, all right, first of all, tell us about the link between alcohol and the heart. You know, previous studies out there have found a positive relationship between moderate alcohol consumption and your heart health. Believe it or not, alcohol has been linked to increases in good cholesterol and some of the properties in blood that actually reduce blood clotting, which make heart attack and stroke less likely. It's also possible that moderate drinking may help reduce your stress levels and also put Put less strain on your heart that way. All right, so tell us about this new study in the British American Journal, or B British Medical Journal, rather. Well, the great thing about this study is that it was 2 million healthy British adults. So That's a lot large of large study, right. And they found that having an occasional drink was actually tied to reductions in heart attack, sudden cardiac death, heart failure, and stroke when you compare it to non-drinkers. -drink the key point here, what is moderate drinking? In the study, seven pints of beer or a bottle and a half of wine per week. And what they found was that moderate drinkers had a 32% low, lower rate of heart attack, 50% risk, uh, lower risk of sudden death, 24% lower risk of heart failure, and 12% decreased risk of stroke. So a big effect and a large study with lots of people. All right, so how do you define that in like a glass a day? What does that mean? And also, what happens if you do even more? So in this study, they looked at, you know, seven glasses of wine, six to seven glasses of wine or pints of beer per week. And if you go over that, heavy drinking resulted in the opposite effect, increased heart risk, including like a 20% risk of sudden death, 22% risk of heart failure, 50% risk of a cardiac arrest, and a third increased risk of stroke. So really, you know, it's a, you know, it's got to be the sweet spot between what's moderate and what's heavy. And if you can't control just don't. Right? Exactly, because alcohol abuse is a huge problem in our society and it's linked to other types of drug abuse like opioids that's in the news here today. Sure, so. sure, absolutely. It's very good information. 